guys welcome back to southern latitudes we have a very very special video for you today as you can see we're in the boat barn anyhow we have guests coming and they are going to show us how to put mushroom spores into an oak log so we can begin that whole process of having mushrooms i'm brand new to this never have done it before but i've been to their house and they have uh, mushrooms all the time and they are delicious i had them for lunch they love shade we're going to hear about that so i'm going to end up putting them over in my banana pit area that gets 100 percent shade okay essentially little a uh, little bit of water at the bottom we're what do you what, uh, water tempering it tempering it like you do chocolate so this is our wax put it in a little tin can of whatever kind and have it in there and let it melt this one's really good that's a good right. length yeah. that's a good length you want it that way length or longer you rather two foot to three foot long okay this particular one this is me I don't like them when they've got a lot of these bumps and everything right. because that's area for infection to come in and other bacteria oh. and other fungus to come in. Okay. Okay. This one's good, but length. That one's pretty good, but these right here. And we covered the the, uh, the scuffs and the ends with wax. Right. So you you're just... sealing it in. Mm -hmm. And this particular one, yeah, we I said really that was don't really care bad. for. Okay, we'll just put that down okay. or away or whatever. You want to use logs that are within a couple of weeks old. If they are older than that, you really look at the quality of them. This is the first time us using this specific bit. It's this designed is, for it's mushrooms. It's designed specifically for mushroom logs. Oh, I read about that. Okay. Yeah. And the length is important. Okay. Okay. Where did you find that? On Amazon? From or? the same place. Oh, from uh, Mushroom Mountain. Yep. And I have shiitake warm and I have phoenix oyster. They they look fuzzy. Do they that's, come that way? Yes, they do. Oh, well, I good. couldn't that's remember. The that's okay. the mushroom spores. Okay. That's saying it's already starting. Eight millimeter log drill bit high speed steel. Yep. So let's go ahead and start with one of these, and that way you can do this one, because I expect this to be the better of them. <laughs> oh, it was really falling okay. apart. Okay, good to know. Don't use rotten ones like that one is. <laughs> right, good explanation. Okay. Demonstration. Okay. So you want to try to have them between four and six inches apart. Okay. Each one of the holes. So that's about a hand width or something? Yeah, that's Ish. what I roughly use. So you go ahead and you come a little off the end, and Do you have to worry about being too close to the edge? I haven't worried too much about it. Okay. The one technique people will do is space about that diamond way. Diamond pattern. That's one way people do it. I actually do a diamond pattern. It's kind of like when you do planting, you get to increase uh -huh. the number. Do you number. want me to hold that still? I, I'm just going to hold it up. Okay. Okay. Now what I do here is I try to count the number I put in. And okay. that way I can mark it on the end of the board. Okay. Okay. That's where going, this, but not that's going. That's where this would come in. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. a strong piece of wood. So. <laughs> <It's just crap. laughs> uh. There you go. Finish putting them in. There you go. You're there. Put several of them under one row and then hammer it in. And then, okay. Yeah, because then you're otherwise. So this back. one's done.
the Phoenix Oyster in blue because shiitake is a warm okay. and warm colors are not blue. Okay, so this one's Does that done. Does make sense? That's mm -hmm. my Until reason. Until we wax in color, so we'll okay. put this okay. in. Okay. So choose your next log to continue. So anywhere you have a score. Notice I'm dabbing, I'm not painting. Now you paint the out the edges. Okay. Because you don't want any other spores of any other kind getting in. And don't throw away that can. Wax on. That's your wax can now. Oh yep. yeah. Right. So just store that in your shed. <laughs> 